generations or generations of African scientists and thinkers who will challenge the likes of Einstein, Marie Curie. It seeks to build an African agenda around science, technology, engineering, and mathematics. It seeks to create a Pan-African platform for young scientists to promote and facilitate innovation, science, and technology. Here, I'm so excited, you know, with this platform for us to meet people from government agencies, from policy makers, <laughs> clinical scientists, you know, space scientists, basic scientists from all levels to see how we can actually come together to solve problems that are local to Africa. Les États membres de l'ONU ont adopté l'agenda 2030 de développement durable qui comprend un ensemble de 17 objectifs mondiaux pour mettre fin à la pauvreté, lutter contre l'inégalité et l'injustice et faire face au changement climatique d'ici à 2030. L'Afrique s'est engagée résolument dans l'éducation et la formation des jeunes, notamment les filles, dans des compétences en sciences et technologies pour assurer son émergence. Mesdames et Messieurs, je voudrais saluer en cette matinée du 8 mars, Journée internationale de la femme, toutes les femmes du monde, mais surtout les femmes africaines. En matière d'intelligence, euh, si on peut dire la vérité, les femmes sont plus intelligentes. Vous me permettrez, mesdames et messieurs, en ce moment précis, de remercier vivement le président Paul Kagame pour son leadership en matière d'innovation. The pressure is on to catch up and keep pace so Africa is not left in the wake of technological progress. Our continent's wealth tomorrow depends entirely on what we put in our children's heads today, they will lighten the world's burdens, not add to them. By creating common health goals across sectors, we can start to identify health generating objectives and strategies. The society we live in today relies increasingly on large-scale complex systems. And space-time and understanding the structure of space-time remains, in my opinion, one of the toughest challenges for humanity in terms of knowledge. I want to talk a little bit about quantum. The word has come up a few places, and uh, I think people haven't really uh, absorbed the fact that a revolution is coming. Et 2017, le Sénégal, en infrastructure et équipement, est en train d'investir plus de 600 millions de dollars. What we want is graduates that are not only the, the greatest in science and technology, but are trained in entrepreneurial skills to have startup companies, to start biotechnology companies, infotech companies in Africa. The Bosch Foundation will stay with you and will continue our support for this great African initiative. What I believe we need to do is really to grasp the opportunities that are being created and to ensure that we convert them to sustainable implementation that really makes a difference on the continent. Looking forward to welcoming you to Kigali for the next forum in 
2018.